I can't film in my usual spot because the light is behind me. Oh, here's a spot. Here's a spot I could prop my phone up. Oh, I think I'd, oh, I could film videos like this. This is great. I could stand. And I'm almost, I'm almost in front of my bookcase. If I just stand back here. I'm finally a real booktuber. I'm filming in front of my books. Some of them. Anyway. But hey -o. so I've just had my shower and yeah, so so what a day. What a day. I've had a pretty I've had a pretty like I'm not gonna say busy, but I've had like a productive day. I've been on like three separate walks with my mom and my dog and then with my dog with my mom, my dog and my dog. I only have one dog. But we went, we took the dog a walk and then we took a little drive. I drove in my new car, which I'm in love with. And we went for a little walk somewhere else, somewhere different. And then we walked to my grandparents' house and we visited my grandparents. We had tea and biscuits with them. And then we walked back to my car and I let my mum drive home because it was her first time driving in my car just to see what it was like. And then we came home, had dinner, we had pizza. I read for a little bit. I've only read like a couple of chapters so far. And then we took my dog for another walk, just to stretch his legs. And then I went for a shower, and now I'm just going to settle in for a night. Probably watch some TV, have a cup of tea. I might read some more, but I think I think it's going to be one of those nights where I maybe end up reading in bed. I think I'll probably do that. I, I prefer to read classicals at night in bed. I don't know why. Classicals? Classics. Classics. Classic novels. I prefer to read classics. So I've officially decided to start Wuthering Heights, which is the book of the month for my Let's Get Classical book club. Is that a dog? So I've officially started it and I'm only on like chapter two. <laughs> yeah, I'm doing so great. And weirdly enough, I feel like with Wuthering Heights, I really know absolutely nothing about it. I know nothing about Wuthering Heights. I know that song by Kate Bush. I've been kind of singing it on off all day. I, it's just in my head. But apart from that, even then, I don't know the whole words of the song. I literally just know that one line. You know, you know the chorus. 
I feel like Wuthering Heights is one of those books that I feel like I've seen it popping up a lot at the moment on like booktube and just book twitter and just everywhere and people have been talking about it and people have been like dissing it not liking it and I feel like other people have kind of said well look don't think of it as like a, a romance think of it as like a romantic tragedy or whatever or just a tragedy or I, I really don't even know I honestly don't even know what it's classed as to be perfectly honest and I really know nothing about it at all I just I know Heathcliff is it, isn't it Cathy? yeah Heathcliff it's me you're Cathy I've come home Heathcliff it's me Cathy I've come home so I but I know it's like Heathcliff uh but that's about it I, I honestly don't know much more about the book about what it's about, about what happens in it. Much the same with most classicals, to be perfectly honest. I really don't, apart from like Pride and Prejudice, which I've probably, I've read most of it anyway, but apart from like Pride and Prejudice, where I kind of knew the story, Elizabeth Bennet and Mr. Darcy, like I knew that, obviously. But like most of our books, classics especially, I don't know what they're about. I really, all the great classics, I don't know what they're about. I don't know. So I have absolutely no idea what's in store for me with Wuthering Heights. I've heard like some people love it, some people hate it. I feel like I may love it. I tend to love most classics. We shall see. I might do some more reading tonight. So, you might not actually hear from me again, but just because if I'm reading in bed, I'm not going to be talking out loud because the whole house is slipping while I am awake and reading. So, you might not hear from me or see my face again, but let's continue on with the vlog. Although it's been more of like, my, my reading vlogs always tend to be more like just my life a day in my life rather than actual reading because unless i'm really doing a lot of reading i tend not to be reading that much in my reading vlogs but oh well sorry about it it's already like half eight the day's over the day is gone